Hello everyone, this is Evie from Dancing Group. It is my pleasure to introduce Dancing Group to you guys. Dancing Group is the leading supplier who can provide one-stop manufacturing and precision service in the fields of customized metal components. The process are casting, forging, machining, stamping, and welding fabrication. Behind me is the display case. Now let's take a look. Today we are here at the Silicon Saw Investment Casting Factory of Dancing Group. Come on, let's see what's going on in the workshop. Hello, this is Amy from Dancing Group. Today we will start with the first part of the process. The first thing is the wax pattern and the mold of the product. The first one, in this process, we will go through the waxing, pressing the wax mold. Now we can see this is a wax injection machine. Come on, let's have a look. After the wax mold is completed, we will trim the wax mold with soft wax or repair wax. For example, burrs or parking lines. And we will also have a check the dimensions in this process. And we will have double check to make sure this is a right size of the product. Now we can see our factory workers is doing the wax mold tree assembly. Now, come on, look with me. The wax mold will be grouped together. Uh, we can see the number of the trees varies depends on the product, the size of and the weight of the product. Hi, this process is dipping and sanding. This, uh, this process will repeat several times depending on different products. And the workshop temperature is kept at 22 to 26 degrees during the air drying. And in the, in the process of the air drying of each product will have a record book. Let's have a look. about what's going on at casting shop. Let's go with Tom and have a look. Hello friends. After the waxing, we come to the calcination and casting. This is a calcinator. The workers put the sand shell into this calcinator to raise its temperature in order to adapt the casting temperature in the next step. And now let's come to the casting. First, we take out the sand shell and put them near the furnace. Look, this is a casting process and before we take out the melting metal, we put some slag remover in order to remove impurities. Now we pour the melting metal from the furnace. Then we pour the melting metal into the sand shell and to get the casting blanks. In casting step, the temperature reaches about 1600 degrees centigrade. Hello guys! Last part, we have learned the calcination and casting. Now I'll show you the shock blasting and cleaning. The first step is vibration of shell. The casting blank and the sand shell can be separated, and we can get the rough casting blanks with pouring gate. Look, this is our shot blasting machine. This is the first shot blasting. We put the castings we have just got into this machine, and we use the steel shot to grind the castings after cooling. And after shot blasting and cleaning, we can get the initial castings with pouring gate. Next, we'll cut the gate and continue to grind by using this shot blasting machine. This time we use the fine shot, and the speed is lower than the first time's shot blasting. This is also a treatment way of surface finish. Now let's take a look at the machine.
Hello everyone, Cardi from Danson. After learning about casting, let's go to the next step of the treatment. This process that can be understood as turning in profession into professor. Look at this side. Pressing, grinding, welding and bending. Look at this machine. This is a resander. Our workers use it to remove the unnecessary sand from our products. In order to ensure the quality of our products, we have many machines to inspect. Like this, the imported spectrum analyzer to test what material includes. Hello everyone, Cardi from Danson. After learning the casting, let's go to the next step, machining. Look at this side. It's our customer's agreement. I'd like to show you this parts we have done before. They are shining, right? Dancing Group has more than 100 sites of equipment. We have 8 large working areas. They are inspection, machining, machining area, drilling, milling, grinding, and ordinary lathe, manual lathe. The main equipment of us are CNC lathe, CNC milling machine, punch, instrument lathe, vertical drilling and typing machine. Here are the area of milling machine used to make surface treatment of precision parts. If you want part with strides, we have two steps. Firstly, we need a drilling machine to drill a hole for parts. Second, we need a typing machine to get internal strides for parts. On my left side is the grinding machine. We use it to grind the surface of the product. It is also possible to do high precision and a small surface roughness grinding. We can ask if a file access machine center, which can be armored in a single pass. It can machine products that are machined in one piece, as well as simple and three-dimensional products. It also has more comprehensive machining range. Hello friends, this is Tom. Just now we have learned so many machining equipments. Now let's come to the inspection room. And before we enter the room, we need to wear shoe covers. Now let's come to the inspection room. This is an image mirroring instrument. It is a coordinate mitology machine designed for the measurement of linear size and geometrical size in computer technology with machine vision for high accuracy measurement and it can measure the linear size. This is a measuring microscope. The measuring microscope indicators are used to make accurate measurements when viewing any sample through the measuring microscope. This is a roundness measuring instrument. The measurement of roundness is of critical importance for many applications. There are several different measurement methods from simple caliper measurements to highly accurate dedicated roundness measurement systems. This is an outline of the measuring instrument, measurement of various mechanical parts of the line shape. This is a coordinate measuring machine. Coordinate measuring machine is a device that measures the geometry of physical objects by sensing discrete points on the surface of the object with a probe. Depending on the machine, the probe position may be manually controlled by an operator or it may be controlled by a computer. This is a Rockwell hardometer. Rockwell hardometer is a general method for measuring the bulk hardness of metallic and polymer materials. This is our packaging. We have wooden case, cardboard, plastic, bubble wrap, and other customized packaging. Those are the process of our product. Thank you very much. If you have any interest, please feel free to contact us. That's the word of manufacturing. Bye bye. Casting, forging, and. <laughs> Amazon Group is the leading manufacturer. Sorry. This is our packaging. Not <laughs> Instrument. Ting. <laughs> <laughs>